It is Monday and it is the afternoon and we're just getting ready. We're packing up our things because today our mission of the day is we're going to a place called Praia da Ursa, which is actually the most western point of Europe. And we've actually been there last year and so we kind of know what to expect. But last year we've only been to the top, to the viewpoint. We've never been down at the beach. So today our mission is to go down to the beach and it's a bit of a hike apparently. So I'm not sure what to expect, but I think we should be fine from what we've read online. It's not the easiest hike, but we're gonna just take our trainers and see how it goes. But I think we should be fine. It's about a 45 minute hike and it takes us an hour to get there. So we're gonna head off now to not miss the good light and to get there in time for sunset. You've got a sigh around your mouth, Janine. We just got to the top oh, of... Um, so this is kind of... It's, it's where there's a lighthouse. It's called Farol do Cabo da Roca. Cabo da Roca. We'll put in the location here. And from here we're gonna walk, but we've never done it before. We've never done it. So we're gonna see where to go down to start the hike now. And we went to the supermarket because we only have one backpack and we had to get a second one for the hike. Because apparently the hike's quite steep. Isn't it beautiful? It's like the cheapest one I could get. A it's five euros. Can't wait to go now. Hi, I feel like Dora the Explorer yeah, with this are, backpack. But I will take it. So, Julia, show us your outfit. I like how. I don't think you'll be able to hear because of the. You place. can put subtitles. Okay. okay. Show like... us the backpack with your beanie. It's super cute. It actually looks really, really cute. We haven't even started the hike yet. <laughs> and we filmed more than we have hiked. <laughs> so, we want to go down there. Now we have to find a way to get down. ridiculous right now but it was such a good call to take the beanie because it was quite windy and it would have been super cold without a hat the walk down was so quick it was only 15 minutes it took us 15 minutes to get down it was totally chilled like I, I expected it to be a lot worse from what we read online and it was really not a hard hike I do recommend wearing so windy I do recommend wearing proper shoes but other than that it's really not bad <laughs> It's Tuesday and today I feel like this is really dark. Also, I've just wanted to film an Insta story and I put a filter on and then I just looked at myself in the camera and it's like so disappointing that you don't look the way you do with a like nice Instagram filter. But anyway, that is not the point because we are in Lisbon right now. We have decided to come here for the day because we I really wanted to get my film developed, which is what Janine's doing right now. I'm just waiting in the car because there's no parking. And then we've got a bunch of stuff that we have to return at Zara and also I want to go shopping. I need to get like long pajamas because it's actually really cold at night. Just a bunch of tops and cute stuff because I don't like any of my clothes anymore. So we want to do a bit of shopping and yeah. So there's our plan for today. We're going to be in Lisbon and then maybe later if we still have time. And if it's not too late, we're going to go to Costa de Caparica and go surf. But we'll see how it goes in Lisbon. But for now, let's do a bit of shopping. <music> We've just come for a super early dinner because we just spent the last four hours going through all the shops. I think we came back with like seven shopping bags because we needed to get stuff for our shoot. I don't know if I said it before. I will insert a picture now of what it looked like with the bags. So I think we've got enough stuff to last us for the next six months. And now we've just come for an early dinner to a place in Lisbon called The Green Affair. It's so good. We've been here before and I take away from here once. It's amazing. It's a vegan food place and the menu is so big. They've got like everything. They've got pasta, burgers, starters, Asian cuisine. Like so, so incredible. So yeah, I really hope they have the burger today.
Good morning. I'm just getting ready to possibly film one or two TikToks. I'm not sure. I've got a couple ideas. I just want to make myself look a little bit more presentable for today. I did a workout this morning and then I worked a little bit and then we met a friend for lunch. But now I need to like film a little bit. So I'm just getting ready. So I thought I would just film and maybe someone's interested in my little very unimpressive very unprofessional makeup routine i'm sure i've done it in other vlogs already but yeah i just put on some concealer wow so i used the benefit goof proof brow pencil in the shade two it's quite light but i don't like it when my eyebrows are super dark also should we have a little catch up let's do it so you guys obviously know that i am in portugal at the moment I'm just putting on some bronzer and at the moment we are staying in a place called Ericeira it is not far from Lisbon and we have been here for a month a month and a half already which is really long but now we are thinking about heading down to the Algarve and staying there just because it is starting to get a little bit colder this part of Portugal like it's obviously like not comparable to the rest of Europe or like Germany or something but it is starting to get a little bit colder and we just prefer warmer climates don't we I don't know, it's so hard to plan ahead at the moment. I've had a lot of uncertainty this year. I think everyone has, obviously. Yeah, just a lot happened and so random. I'm like talking about my life and then I'm doing my makeup. Let's put on some blusher. I've just put it like everywhere. Like I even put it on my nose because it looks like, looks like I've been in the sun. And the last thing that I'm going to do, I've just curled my lashes. And then uh, the last thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to use the banner. I use the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. Oh my God, shocking. I don't know. But yeah, that's it. Someone walked past. Oh, he's still there. He's not even ugly. With a setup by the window. Why is it always me? This is just so embarrassing. Okay, let's try again. I just filmed, I think, three TikToks overall, which it wasn't too bad, but I don't know. I don't know how happy I am with them. I already posted one. And now I am treating myself to brownies janine made these i want a big piece with lots of icing how good is this it's vegan gluten-free maybe sugar-free who knows mm -hmm. oh my gosh so nice i'm gonna have another one and then we're gonna go skating now raining almost the entire day it's just been a patch of like bad weather but that's okay because i feel like when the weather's bad like i'm just so much more productive because i feel like i'm not missing out and it's been really good because i've just been working ahead for next week so next week when it's supposed to be really nice weather and really good waves and really sunny i can just enjoy my time and not think about work too much because i've paired everything for next week which is good but now i really need to get out of the house and we're gonna go for a little beach walk and get some fresh air and make the most of the little break from the rain i think there's nothing nicer than like a gloomy beach walk i think it's so cozy <music> to get out of the house and get some fresh air i feel like it's just the cure for everything just being by the ocean it doesn't even have to be sunny and hot like i just feel like once you're by the ocean it just makes everything better and i actually yeah like i said i really do love a gloomy beach walk there's something so nice about it and now we're just heading to the supermarket get some stuff for dinner i think i want to make a curry because we've been eating out too much so i need to like eat at home i can just feel myself like not feeling 100 percent when we eat out too much so yeah we're gonna buy some nice ingredients for a delicious curry thank you guys so much for watching this vlog if you're not subscribed already please make sure to do so and give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment it really supports my channel thank you guys and i will see you in my next video bye